I am joined by Rodney and Darlene Waldner, brother and sister, who are here in Lethbridge promoting their new book, Since We Told the Truth. Now, this is a sequel to a book that, that you wrote last year, correct? Yes. Okay. Hutterites is more uh, our life growing up on the Hutterite colony and it, what it was like leaving. So it shares our experiences from back then. And then Sense the Truth will be more what our life has been since we wrote this book. So Hutterites is, we go in depth. The things how we felt growing up as a, from a young child, the things we went through, but then we also share the experience of leaving, why we had to leave. We had to leave for our faith in Jesus Christ in order to serve God fully. We had to leave the Hutterite colony. So we share those steps and we want to encourage other people that are in that kind of situation we want to encourage them. If you are in a tough situation, mm. you have to make that decision for yourself. Can't look to anybody else. So nine, but this is about nine of us ex hutterites that left Colony in Manitoba and North Dakota. Okay, now why do you think um, this book resonated with so many people? It's a, a, a lot, you've gotten a lot of really good uh, feedback about it and people wanted to hear another book from you guys. I believe the first book exposed a lot of what's going on inside Hutterite colonies that people had never heard about. And our heart was to go beyond Hutterite life, to bring solutions to problems of all kinds of what people are going through, because we, we go through similar situations that people do that are not Hutterites. And this book is more, it goes into a national perspective and bringing awareness to people of the solution, our heart is to tell people how much God loves each one of us. Now there were nine of you young people that, yes. that sort of came together and found each other all leaving for, for similar reasons. Yes. And how difficult has it been to step away from the colony and make a life on your own? I guess stepping out of the colony, when I look back, was kind of the easy part. It was adjusting to uh, kind of what the real life is like you have to communicate you have to, to share with people you can't just keep to myself anymore and it was hard because first of all I like for me I was struggling with depression while getting out of that but then being getting established and the freedom that we found in Jesus Christ that's what helped all nine of us that's what we all had in common and I believe that's one of the things that people like to hear our story because I think everybody wants to hear a message of freedom Everybody likes to hear like a story of how we overcame. So this is hitting bookstores now. You guys are doing the circuit. You're hitting all the book signings. Yes, we are. We are doing a book signing, a book tour in Canada. Now we went up all the way up to Calgary, Alberta, um, Edmonton, came down here in Lethbridge, and we're having a lot of fun meeting people. It's such a different life than we came out of. We used to have all these walls set up to like c cutting people off or just being closed off to people on the outside and now people coming up to our table and just talking, having a relationship with people that we've never met before. We never knew that was possible. It took a lot of adjusting, but we enjoy it. It's so much fun. We're very thankful to the Lord. Rodney, Darlene, Waldner, you're two of the authors, two of the nine authors of your latest book, Since We Told the Truth. Fascinating stories of, of freedom there. Thank you so much for having us.